years old and no driver's license. Fucking ridiculous. I could have stayed and hired another cameraman. Well, have some jerk with a shitty camera and no eye shoot it? Forget it. Look, we'll bail him out, drive him to the rehab, and drive right back up. We'll just be a little late. I don't understand. The lawyer gave him, got a deal that he got six months in rehab or three years in prison, and he... And the judge gave him 10 days to enter the rehab, and on the seventh day, he got arrested again. Jamie. What am I supposed to do? He's my brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, no. I got an idea. We could interview him about his experiences. No, it's not the film I'm making. I'm not interested in some privileged white kid who got himself into trouble. Just because he's white doesn't make him privileged, Bella. That's Stop not pigeonholing what I'm people. I'm not pigeonholing him. He's I'm... a victim of the very system we're trying to he's expose with our movie. He's a victim of his own stupidity. What? If he doesn't get to the rehab by 8 p.m. tomorrow, he's going to prison. You hear that clinking sound? Yeah, my car's been doing that. I don't know what it is. Have you checked the oil? When was yeah. last time you checked the oil? I put veggie oil in it yesterday. Not veggie oil. Engine oil. What about your mom? Can't she help him? I... Our mom lives in a cave in Greece. Our father's dead. Our grandmother's Alzheimer's and don't even ask me about his friends. God, I hate LA. It's so barren. Just wait till you meet him, okay? Camera. Yeah. <laughs> ah. It's okay? Ah, yeah. Oh, yeah. How are you doing? Hi. Thank Ca you. Uh, cash or credit? Uh, credit. Okay. This. Uh. So do you mind if I ask you how you became a bail bondsman? Yeah, it's a family business. Sign here, rent here, initial. So uh, why do you pack that gun? This? Yeah. Oh, this is a... Uh... Oh, you don't have to pull it out. Oh, it's an insurance policy. <laughs> Yeah. What do you uh, mean? A lot of people think uh, bear bondsmen care about the money. Uh, we don't. It's all paper. <laughs> if a brother doesn't show up to court, yeah, I have to go after him. If I not find him, I go after you. Oh, okay. <laughs> For the money. <laughs> Put it away. Put it's it like, away. Okay. Like okay. Rambo. Like, oh. oh, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> Take care, All right, man. then, Leo. Okay. What's up, Leo? <laughs> Each day is better than the next. <laughs> We're in the Volvo right here. I meet my girlfriend. My name's Bella. Just drove all the way down here from San Francisco. Bella, this is Leo. Hi, Leo. This and we should go. Fuck you. Fuck you. It means I'll do it in Romania. So, uh, why were you arrested this time? <laughs> it's because I'm black. And, uh, what happened to your shoes? Well, I don't know. <laughs> you were in a cell barefoot? They gave me shoes, but they were awful, so... I was pretty good barefoot, you know? <laughs> I was running from the cops, right? I fell over a wall. Boom! <clears throat> Fucked up my ankle. The pigs caught up to me, and my slippers were gone. They're my favorite slippers, too. Blue, the little gold. What happened to your shirt? It's fucking hot. It has balls in here. Uh, I'm cold. 
My shirt? Fucking cigarettes. I, I fell asleep with a lit, lit cigarette in my hand. I wake up and my favorite fucking pajamas are ruined. I feel sick. Any laxatives? No. No, no, or no? Should we get the check? Um, Mila, we need to go to the market. I need to get laxatives, cigarettes, and shoes. OK, but can you do that fast? Because we got to go. I saw a market next door. OK, let's go. Let's go right now. I'll pay the check. Just go fast. All right. You want anything? No. You all right, babe? Yep. OK, we'll be right back. OK. It hurts to see you again like this, Leo. Still addicted to the camera, I see. Thought about seeking help. Admitting you have a problem is the first step. Do you want to help me or you're just going to film me? You're heading the right way. Okay, pull him right there. This is it? Yeah. Oh, perfect. All right. I cool. gotta get my card. The impact. I left right here. Impact. Yes. Oh, this is the impact. No, 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 no. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you have a car. Yes. All right, perfect. You can drive yourself to the rehab because we gotta right get right back here. to San Francisco. No, 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 no. He's not driving himself. He doesn't have a license, insurance. Look at him. Leo, That's we're not necessary. we're not getting your car out of the impound. What do you want me to do? You want me to drive both cars? I have a 1960 black Impala. It's beautiful. It's, it's a twenty thousand it. dollar car. It's a, car. It's a twenty thousand dollar car. You can have it to go up north. I just need you to pay the impound fee. It's only eight hundred dollars. I can't leave my car here, Leo. What do you want me to do? <laughs> See that car? Yeah, I just, it just seems kind of crazy to leave my car here. I don't even know where Maybe we your are. your car was falling apart. All right. I'm, I'm gonna go check on, on, on the impala. No, I'm, I'm coming. Don't leave. I'm coming. Do you have a card? I could. It's okay. Leo, that car is so cool. What's wrong? Get in. Leo, you can't drive. Get in the car. You can't drive. You don't have a driver's license or insurance. Got the patience for you. Billy, get in the car. I'm going to show you how to drive it. Yo, what's up, man? How you doing? Hermes wants to wash that gel off of me. 
oh, shit, because he's not feeling too good. You guys are making a film about him? Who? Your brother. What'd you call him? Oh, fuck, my bad. I called him Hermes, man. He got that name because he's always wearing that fancy scarf of his. Crazy ass white boy, man. He keeps a statue of me in my closet. I know, I'm not making a movie about my brother. This camera's just a bad habit. Tell me about it. We are creatures of habit, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Hello there. They call me Black Aries. Hi, I'm Bella. Mm -hmm. Do you mind if I um, took a walk? Oh, man, go do your thing. Thank you. Where are you going? I just need to cool off a little. You mind if I ask you how you know my brother? Oh, shit, man, I know your brother from back in the days. We used to do graffiti together. You can still see big-ass giant size Hermes and Black Aries pieces everywhere, man. It was a beautiful thing, lovely. You mind if I ask uh, how you got injured? Yeah, sure, man. I was a contractor in Afghanistan. After being a soldier in the first Cold War, I realized I'd make a lot more money working for them damn devils in the State Department as a mercenary, you know what I mean? I was in Hellman's province. You know, that's the real rowdy side and shit, you know? I was over there doing this thing, what they call crop substitution. Man, I'm telling you, just out of nowhere, boom, drug lords just hit us real hard, or some kind of fucking lords, man. They definitely were running the place. You must have been a lot of pain. Well, they got some real good painkillers down there. Real good. We ready? Yeah, we're just waiting on Leo. Shocking. Oh. Man, please, thank you so much. I've been meaning to get this place asphalt and shit, you know. It's gonna happen one day. Thank you so much. You good? Oh, yeah, I'm good. Thank you, Bella. What's up? Mila. Yes? What are we doing? We're, uh, waiting on my brother. I told you. You know what? Put the camera down. I want to talk to you. Put it down. It's down. It's down. It's down. Your brother has some serious fucking problems, Mila. I know, that's why we're here. Yeah, I get that, I get that, but I really thought I was gonna fucking die in the car back there. Jesus Christ, I mean, you didn't, you didn't tell me that he was like, like... Like the very same people who tried to help with our movie? Oh, please, Milo, I know you're smart enough to know that there's a difference between uh, trying to expose a systemic problem that affects hundreds of thousands of people and risking our lives for one lone maniac. That makes sense, coming from someone who doesn't speak to her own parents for political reasons. Look, baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? Look, my brother's just part of the package for a few more hours. Please, just bear with me. Fine. Please. Fine. Where is he? Leo, let's move it, man. Come on. I'm gonna wait in the car. Come on, man. I gotta get my ass to rehab. Let's go. Aries! Wee! Oh, come on, man. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the Hollywood sign. Oh, you better do that shit, man, like old times. Man, put me up too. Don't forget the Black Aries, baby. Hey, each day's better than the next. It's gonna get better, man. <laughs> the worst. <laughs> Hello. You drive, I don't have a license or insurance. <laughs> Ma'am? Come on, Mila, you wanted to go so badly. Ugly, ugly!
You know that uh, park that we just passed? That park right the fuck there. The one we just passed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I fell asleep underneath a picnic table there. Shit, I can't And I was awakened to laughter by a gaggle of giggling girls. The next thing I know, they invite me to a pajama party. Oh, these girls. They were, you know, I go to, I go to their house. That one right there. So I used to be on the scene. Put on my pajamas, and it's on the second floor. I'm just trying to get used to my new wheels here. 10 o'clock, 2 o'clock, that's like a gun. Just uh, aim and shoot. We're getting our swivel on, and suddenly, the chick's boyfriend comes home. And um, he's not happy. Oh, I'm jumping out the fucking window. I blaze off in the Impala. I'm going a buck 20 down Burbank. I hit Chandler, Colfax. The cops are on my ass. So I ditch the car. I'm running down to Topanga in my fucking pajamas. And I, uh, wh where do I go after that? Slam! I fall over a wall that's connected to an alleyway. Ten seconds later, I had one of those Nazis arms on my head. And the rest, as they say, is uh, a mystery. Wow, but we picked you up like 30 miles away from here, all the way in a place called Calabasas. I don't... well... <laughs> Maybe it wasn't here. I don't know, L.A. looks all the same to me. Oh, shit. <laughs> Los Angeles sticks. Has he been treating you well? No, but what else is new, right? You just give me the order and uh, I'll make them dead. Really? Forget about it. <laughs> what do you want? Well, let's talk later. All right. You smell nice. Thank you, Leah. Hey, I got you uh, a little gift. What'd you get me? In my travels, uh, it's. Uh, I found it in uh, Nigeria, and uh, it will bring you luck. Thank you. Africa ain't just the country that gave us Bob Marley. All right, follow me. <laughs> Come on. You don't get it? It's money. Vivian, Vivian, me amor, Vivian. Give me a twelve, Vivian. Just one. Come on. <laughs> All right. Have a seat. Harry's gonna be with you in a minute. You're gonna wanna put that away. Milo, she's not fucking around. Put that away. Five minutes in and out. Wait a minute, get a shot of the bear quick first. <laughs> Where's Bella? She's uh, waiting in the car. What? She's waiting in the car. Harry. Hello, Leo. Oh, thank you. Is that my file? Got your file right here, Leo. That camera's not on, is it? No, no. Milo. How was your day? Excellent, Leo. So, Leo. Yes. I gotta ask you something, okay? Shoot. Who the fuck do you think you are? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Well, you know you're fucking me like a tie hooker on payday, right? <laughs> are you serious? Yeah, a little bit. Well, you know, do you think that the judge agreed to send you to, to rehab because he thinks you can get rehabilitated? <laughs> <sighs> are you asking me? No. No? <laughs> How about 
the fuck no? How about he agreed to send you to rehab because of me? Because of Larry K. Rusty? Because he knows me? And with that hanging on the line, and with me making it abundantly clear to you that my reputation hangs in the balance, you and your infinite fucking wisdom disappear for three fucking days. Then I find out that you get arrested in Calabasas. So you tell me you shit for fucking brains. Don't you think that I got better things to do than work for you, you stupid fucking donkey cunt? I got a little worked up sometimes because I really believe in my work. I know. Now I want you to be clear, absolutely clear that you're there by 8 p.m. And do not forget the 5,000 in cash or they will not even admit you. Got it, HR. Will do. Thank you. Everybody get out of here. Scared the shit out of my brother. Yeah, but he's all right. Uh, uh. Uh. <laughs> Leo, where the fuck are you gonna get $5,000 in cash? I got it covered. Just head down to Mahon. You guys want a tan? What are you doing? <laughs> it's gonna get way darker. And no skin cancer, it's fucking cool as fuck. That shit's gonna make you orange. Wait, is this Mahalan up here? No, no, keep going straight. You're gonna hit it. Do I look orange? No, I look tan. Listen, it contains a gentle tanning agent that blends with your natural skin tone so your color change is subtle. See? Subtle, not shocking. Well, why do you want to be tan? Wants to be black. I am black. <sighs> I'm supposed to be in Hawaii right now, so uh, I gotta look the part for the homies in rehab. But you know the people in rehab? Yes, it's always the same people at these places. Actually, it's where we first tried heroin. I'm going to rehab. <laughs> don't laugh at me, I'm serious. Really? Yeah, really. Well, then why don't we go have one last um, going away party? Cut. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I told you guys not to. Yes! Thank you, Daphne. $5,000. Bella. <laughs> what? The check's made out to you. Let me see. It's made out what? to you. Why the fuck does it have my name on it? Well, actually, it's from Daphne's husband, Ernie. Daphne doesn't have a checking account, or at least that's what she's called. Marjorie, this way to the Marjorie. Might look easy, but it's hard to do. An ounce of blow in the afternoon. Ernie's a producer and the arms dealer on the side. <laughs> Daphne let me borrow his car, and uh, he's pissed. Baby. I'm addicted to friction. Grab your hips, switch the position. Why your man in the bathroom sniffing? So he knows my last name, Leslie Milos, so on and so on. Can you please stop Which way to the Marjorie? This way to the Marjorie. You got your check? Thank you. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah, be careful with that. 
Nice girl. She's a breeder. <laughs> What's wrong, man? Nothing. It's just like nothing has changed. Nothing. It's like you expect me to be your 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 nurse, your caretaker, your banker, whatever else the fuck I can come up with. No, I don't. I'm not always gonna be there to bail you out, you know. No, I won't. It's like you have no idea how your choices affect people. Me or mom or Bella now. Can you stop? Please? Oh. What is this? Is this annoying? Stop. Stop. Put it away. Please. It's not a toy. Please. Come on. Now you know what it's like. Fuck you, man. <laughs> no, Please no, go no, no, fuck no. yourself in English. We good? Yeah. yeah. What do you mean, though? Maybe we should call Ernie. I think he's useless. I felt like a fucking idiot in there. Yeah, have you ever thought about just fucking giving up and just doing your time? Kill myself before I go back to jail. I almost got stomped to death for speaking with a fellow black man. The white dudes didn't realize I was Italian. Head up to King's Road, it's in Hollywood. Falling into the habit I can't. I've done at least three times each day. Are we stick to burglary? Fucking cunt. How's it going, Max? It's f what the fuck is this? Hello. Hi. Max is gonna save a brother from incarceration, aren't you, Max? That's... Switch that shit off, try for a second. Uh. What, did I wake you? Yeah, you woke me. Well, wakey, wakey. Eggs and bakey. <laughs> Max, uh, Bella, Milo? Hi. Sit down. It's okay, sit. It's okay. We're friends. Ish. <clears throat> Aren't you gonna introduce us to your friend? It's Troy. Troy, it's Leo. Stephanie. Bella. Got a light? No. There's... So, uh... My brother says you're gonna help him. With what? I'll help you with what? What the fuck are you got? What do you want from me, man? You know what I want, Max. Oh, come on, man. You know, you hear, it's not about the fucking $3,000 that I apparently owe you. $3,000? <laughs> For what? Oh, Jesus. It was a fucking drunken night of backgammon, okay? It was pissed off my fucking tits, and uh, it was stupid, okay? I'm, uh, I don't know, $3,000. Oh, what are you Leo. doing, man? Come on. Giving you an opportunity, Max. Fucking house cleaner. One more round, 11 points, double or nothing. You win, we're even. I win, six grand. Five for rehab and one for my uh, brother and his wife. I'm not his wife, he's a partner. Most people think it's a game of luck. Actually, it's largely a matter of nerve. Where's your nerve, Leo, Lux? Leo, Leo, just listen to me, man. Leo, just listen to me, okay, buddy? We, we're not playing back, I'm mean, okay. I've got no fucking money. I've got zero money. There's nothing, okay? Leo, are you listening to me? I mean, I haven't had a fucking audition in, in like a year. Oh, it's Troy. I haven't had a fucking phone call in a month from my agent. He's probably fucking dead. You're a fucking actor, Max. Fuck you. You want to see my fucking showreel? I'll put it on. No, no, that's okay, Max. I don't want to see your showreel. Listen, listen, I've got a solution here, okay? I'm going to get you guys an espresso and we will calm down and fucking talk this out. Do you want an espresso, Stephanie? Love Steph Bella, yes. How do you guys are fucking. Just relax. An espresso machine? No, just an espresso. Yeah, this is oh, a graduation yeah. present from my mother, and I'm not going to give you this. This is my baby, okay? Looks like your baby's taking a trip, Max. Give me the oh, cup. Leo. Come on. 
Leo, 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 for fuck's sake, man. You're a fucking cunt. <coughs> I'm a cunt with a new cappuccino machine. It's it's an espresso machine, you fucking moron. What the fuck are we doing? This is insane. I don't know about you guys, but I'm collecting a lot of debt. The baby's worth at least a thousand dollars. You stole it, Leo. We're accomplices to this fucking bullshit. I know. Did you see the look on his face? You're fucking heartless. It was the only thing he had in his entire apartment. I thought it was a present from his mom. <laughs> oh, my God. Look, why don't we just find somebody to buy this car legally? That would make a lot more sense, I think, than fucking stealing espresso machines. That might be tough. What do you mean? I mean, uh, it's complicated. Let me guess. The car's not really ours. It belongs to someone who doesn't exactly exist. What? What, <laughs> what are we gonna do? <laughs> We're gonna sell the car. I got a place. I gotta drive it in. They know me. I gotta oh, drive no. it in. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's personal diary, no one sees it. How you doing? Plus, I got a little surprise. Mikey, you grab the cups in the thing. It's the it's a cardboard thing to the left. There's cups and saucers. Yeah, that's it. Let me taste the shit. What's, uh... <laughs> What's going on in there? Uh... I think they're selling my stolen car. Milo, you turn the camera off? Can you please turn it off? You turn it off, please, please. <clears throat> What's up? What's your name? It's all right, Dr. Hey, yeah, I don't trip. It's cool. You sure? Since you're Hermes' brother and all, it's cool. Cool with you and your high note right here. Fools around here call me Diego. How do you know my brother? Hermes? <laughs> Everybody knows Hermes. So you guys jack cars too and shit, you know, like some Bonnie and Clyde type shit. No, 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 that's that, that's, uh, that's Hermes, I mean, that's... Leo, Hermes' car. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Hey, you want to hear some crazy shit about your brother? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Check this out. Like 10 days ago, Roddy read me a 2004 Maybach. Cherry. He was up in the hills with some producer's wife or some shit, you know, getting doing this thing, his Hermes yeah. thing. <laughs> so he's about to jet and he sees the keys. Space miss opportunity, right? I'm telling you, this motherfucker's a beast. So he snatches up the car. Now, this is a $350,000 car we're talking about here. And he's high as a kite. I mean, loaded. <laughs> Balls of steel, man. So you guys hear the double your money too and shit, or? Double what money? Hey, check this out, dog. Be careful with that footage there, because ain't nobody got me or my operation on tape. You know, it's gonna be worth a million bucks someday. Right. Hey, Dee. Bella, from the homeland. Ah, thank you. Be careful, it's hot. What the? It's your new machine. You Decaf? Have a in my heart. <laughs> Vince, Vince and I talked it all out. Let me just grab something from the car real quick. $500 in cash, plus this beautiful car. Better than the Impala. I don't, I don't know. I think I like the Impala better. Are you crazy? This is classic waiting to happen. Get in. Well, all our shit's in the Impala. It's we in the trunk. Get, get in. Feel that? Okay. It's like, it's like you're on your favorite sofa. You know, you're gonna fall asleep in seconds. You'll enjoy it. Nilo, stop filming me and get the foot in the car. Okay? Hey, I think we're even, bro. <laughs> You think you got up on me, D, don't you? See you next week. Just a minor mouth on it. She hums like a kitten. Get in.
I think Bella's got to drive, though. Why is that? Isn't this her car? Borrow, you didn't borrow shit, Leo. You stole Daphne's husband's car and took it to a chop shop. It's not a chop shop, it's a parts place. Who do you work for? The FBI, the CIA, the IRS? How do you expect to stay out of prison if the you're going AARP? around stealing Israeli arms dealers' cars and selling them at fucking chop shops? What'd you do with the money from the Maybach? I spent it. I just, I can't believe you only got $3,500 and this car for my Impala. Which you said was worth $20,000. You're not gonna get blue book prices at a parts place. And this is a beautiful car, Bella. La la la. <laughs> Leo, where are we gonna get the rest of the money? First, let me pay my uh, debt to Bella. I owe her uh, $800. All right. Hold on, 440, 60, 80. It's a hundred for my for my dead fellow. Okay, stop. Just keep your money. Consider it my donation to the Keep Leo Out of Prison Fund. Are you sure? Yeah. And I'm gonna waste the next couple hours trying to make that eight hundred dollars back. <laughs> you married a seat? I'm not married. I'm telling you. Whatever you guys are, she's a saint. Are you guys hungry? No. Yes, I'm starving. That's what you can do. You can buy me lunch. <laughs> This place has the best octopus dumplings on earth. Mm. Better than in China, I swear. China, this is a Vietnamese restaurant. It's both, it's a hybrid. Could you bring us some Arctic surf clams with sesame chili oil? Crispy, deep-fried pork intestines, deep-fried duck tongue with spicy salt, half a dozen hundred-year-old eggs, pan-fried sea cucumber with supreme gravy. You want to order of chicken feet? I always like to do, like, an experiment. Scoop goat in a hot pot with rice and noodles. Do you guys want any? Leo, we don't have time. Hold that thought, food. I gotta hit the head. Leo, we don't have time. Can you just get some noodles or something? All right, I think we're good. I can't believe you ordered all this food. I mean, he's okay. It's been there a while, like 20 minutes. As soon as he gets back, we're gonna drop him off, we're gonna go to the airport, we're gonna fly to San Francisco, and we'll be there in time to do our interviews this afternoon. I canceled the interviews. You did what? I canceled the interviews. Hours ago. Why would you do that? Because we were never going to make it. And I should have known that this morning yeah. at 5 a.m. <clears throat> when I agreed to do this. And you should have known it. Because you know what your brother's like. And you knew we were never going to make this happen. You knew we were never going to be able to come down here, swoop him into rehab, and drive back up there in time. This, this is our mission now, OK? We're going to go. <sighs> Leo, what is your plan? What do you want to do? Milo, come on. You've been pretty chill all day. Why the sudden bout of anxiety? Bella, you have to try the 100-year-old egg. Yeah, it's fermented in straw and horse urine Blah. for like six months. No, it is wonderfully, you. wonderfully perverse. A little too perverse for me. No, thanks. <clears throat> Come on, live a little. Bella? It smells like ass. I dare you, Bella. Bella, what are you doing? You're She's vegan. She's living life. Oh. I, I can't believe you're eating that. <laughs> oh my god. It's good, right? Not as bad as you would think. A world without a hundred year old eggs is not worth living in. That and truffles found by dogs and imported from Italy. Mm. I think pigs find truffles. The best are found by dogs. I want to try something else. All right, how about uh, the chicken feet? If I could, I'd weigh 600 pounds. I used to weigh 220 until I started what? using again. Yeah. You? I don't believe it. I lost 60 pounds in three months. Mm, what's your secret? <laughs> I could put you on the diet, but I don't think it'd be happy. Oh, I see. <laughs> yeah, you don't want the diet that he's on. Pay the check. What? Meet me around back. 
may have solved our money problems. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I knew there was something up with this place. That's disgusting. Our worries are over. You stole a dog now? Bought him, 100% legal. Rescued him from an uncertain phase of homemade side dish. Oh, you did what? It's just 500, relax. Paco's a champion English bulldog who was trained in Germany as a police dog. We'll get 2,000 for an easy. Watch. Taco. Plots. Plots. Taco plots. No, he doesn't feel like plots. Okay. Come on, Taco. Inside. Inside. Come on, Taco. Here we go. Inside. Here we go. Come on. I can't believe you bought a fucking dog. He's cute. Oh, my God. You slobbed it all over my camera. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, fuck! Sneezed! <laughs> Bella, take a left. What time is it? It's like 12 something. Perfect. What do you mean perfect? Just take a right right here, Bella. What's going on? These are my boys. One of them will buy the dog for sure. Just pull him to the gas station over there. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What the fuck? What's up? Ducati. Uh, he's born in Italy, like me, trained in Germany. He's like a $6,000 police dog. Police dog? Yeah, well, you better watch out! Just listen, I'm in a little bit of a situation, so I'm willing to let him go for like two. 200? Two stack. Damn! I'll give you two bills right now, I think. So. Can't do it, big homie. Hey, where's uh, Dizzy at? Dizzy? It's over there. No taco sec. Taco? Ducati. His nickname's Taco. Just <laughs> watch him, all right? Uh, sure, apparently. $2,000? What dog's gonna die of heat exhaustion? Give me the money, man. We're not gonna have anything left at the rate you're spending it. What, you don't trust me? It's not that. It's just that we both saw you give that guy dizzy money. I owed him. Just 20 flax. And then you went into the bathroom and... and... To shit! You don't know what it's like trying to come off drugs. I had the wrong name with him. Um... Bill, does he still live in Venice? You read my mind. Who's Bill? My dog? Bill is a very rich, very eccentric family friend. I love the million more. Are you gonna ask him? No, you ask him. I'm not gonna ask him. All right. Where the fuck is he? Mind the camera? No, I'm used to it. I, I wouldn't know you without it. So, um, what are you working on? 
looking at these little mini handcuffs here, and I was wondering if I could make some thumb cuff kind of jewelry. You know, I thought, well, I'm just not sure how to. You know, can't really put them like that because you can't do so. I don't know if you've seen much of Leo lately, but he's developed a bit of a uh, drug problem. Well, you know, life's been uh, a little easier for you and a little harder on Leo. I feel an affinity with Leo, yeah. and and I, I also understand, you know, what it is to deal with a, with a drug problem. I've got a lot of friends that, uh, you know, just ain't here anymore. A little miscalculation here, a, a little error there. It's not like a, you're doing some big noble deed to help someone, but you know that if you don't, then, you know, he could be dead. Leo got himself into a little trouble, so we've come to ask you for a little loan. Sure, no problem. Uh, five, ten dollars, what can I do? We gotta get him into rehab, and we need $2,500. Well, fuck him. <laughs> Well, I sing you a true song about Billy the Kid. I sing you the record of deeds that he did. Way out in New Mexico a long time ago, when a man's only friend was his own 44. This is how Billy the Kid met his fate A big moon was shining and the hour was late Shot down by Pat Garrett, Silver City's best friend The poor outlaw's life in the region's sad end This is what's gonna happen to Federico if he keeps the old people in our business. Leo, I'm not other people. When did you get out? I escaped. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. Mm. Oh, this is my brother Milo. Camera crew. Hi. <laughs> hi. Hi, hi, I'm Milo. <laughs> This is his wife, Bella. Hi, partner, actually. Hi, Carmen. Nice to meet you. Partner, actually. Come in. <laughs> God, these paintings are amazing. Thanks. You did all these? Wow. I'm about to have my first one woman show. Oh, that's so cool. So Brad's not going to be home for a couple hours, so make yourselves at home. So who's Brad? Brad's your boyfriend. I've never met him. And I'm not jealous. I've been trying to get her to run away with me to Inner Mongolia. I'd wear like a black suit with red trim. She'd wear a red veil. There'd be little ponies everywhere. <sighs> I'm totally Twitter painted, can't you tell? Twitter painted, huh? Ain't you ever seen Bambi? <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hello? Yes, this is she. Can you hear me? No, I, I don't. Hold on one second. What's up, guys? Mila, how about a little bit of privacy? Oh, sorry, sorry. Jesus. Sorry. Sorry. problem you guys are having. Yeah. I think I can help. Really? We have shave. We're not gonna smoke it. We sell it. We break it up into four quarters. 
and sell it for about twelve fifty a pop. Yeah, that adds up to five thousand. It turns us into total drug traffickers. It sounds worse than it is, but it's how I paid my way through art school. Really? It's only pot. It's practically legal in California. Wait, let's just figure out if this is our only option. No, it's, it's not legal. It's not legal. I mean, if, if, even if we had a doctor's note, it wouldn't cover us for transporting a pound of marijuana. This is insane. We do a drug deal, get me into rehab, and then the student becomes a teacher. Listen, I have this do, lawyer do, do, friend do. up north who got this guy off for having 150 plants. And to top it off, at the end, the government gave him his plants back. Can I have his number? It's a she. See, men get into trouble, <laughs> women get them out. Sound a little familiar? <laughs> Can I have her number? I think I might need a new lawyer. Listen, you guys, we can do this. It's only a phone call away. I even know people who want to buy it. Let's just phone. focus on selling taco. This is becoming a pain. No, in the ass. no one's gonna want to buy that stupid dog, Leo Jesus. It's not a stupid dog. By feelings, they'd be hurt. You guys, look. Listen, I'll carry the stuff in my purse. We get busted, I'll take the responsibility. No, you guys I... just play dumb. Are you sure? Yeah. Whatever, you know what I think. All right, we'll call him and see what he says. Are you seriously okay with this? You know, I mean, we do our best and we hope for the best. If we get busted, we're completely fucked. <laughs> you know, I can't believe you're saying this now. At this point today, we have driven a stolen car, sold the stolen car, sold a stolen espresso machine, and let a convicted felon buy and use drugs. We Either we commit problem, a crime really. or we watch Leo go to prison. He's busy, but he'll call us back in an hour at the spot to meet him. All right. Let me get you in the rehab. Let's go swimming. Swimming, actually, sounds like a good idea. Hello, what has gotten into you? This is why we came down here, right? Do a swimming? I don't even recognize you right now. You know, come on. There's nothing more we can do about our shoot today, OK? It's fucked. And at this point, we just have to wait for Carmen's friend to call. And it's hot, and I have not showered, and I'm exhausted. And yeah, swimming actually sounds like a good idea. Stop living your life like one giant fucking documentary. Come on, answer me. Answer you? You're looking through the lens. For fuck's sake, who am I talking to? You? You're talking to all of us. You're talking to her, to her. You're talking to the camera. You're talking to me. Come on, for the record. Speak. I appreciate you guys came down here. Fuck. I do, but I didn't make you. Excuse me? I didn't make you guys come down here. I gotta hear your this. choice. Face it, the only reason why you came down here in the first place is you don't want to feel guilty about not helping out your brother. Plus the That's fact... That's the most warped reason I've ever heard of You still of feel bad life. about the time you sent me to jail. I didn't That's send really him to jail. That's really why you're here, isn't it? No. Right, that's the biggest fucking piece of horseshit I've ever heard. <laughs> I care, he cares, we're here. God damn it, you are the most ungrateful person I've ever met in my entire life. I can't believe you. Ungrateful? Yeah, ungrateful. He doesn't really care. What the fuck are you talking about? How he can doesn't. he not care? Listen, he'll call He'll call my girlfriend and say, I'm worried my little brother's dead. And she'll say, uh, come over for dinner, talk to him. And he'll say, ah, oh, that's okay, I'll call in a couple weeks. I'm a out of town. A couple weeks. I'm out of town. You're always out of town, man. What does he mean, sent me to jail? I didn't send him to jail. The worst idea ever. Next time, <laughs> I'll kill you. What? You got arrested at this motel, and the cop said, you live over on Laurel Canyon? Your brother sent us three days ago. It was, it was your friend who called saying, your brother's gonna die, he's been doing speedballs for 10 days, and he's gonna die, and if you wanna live with yourself, and you know you could've done something to stop it, that's up to you. And what happens? When I get stabbed in jail because you call the fucking cops. Does he, does he cop up to that? To that phone call he made saying, your <laughs> brother's gonna die if you don't call the police? Why didn't, why didn't he call then? He said, I'm not his brother, you are. 
Wow, so riddle me this, Sherlock. What happens when I find a dirty needle in jail and get some kind of weird disease? People don't shoot up in jail, do they? What? People shoot up in jail? Yeah, the whole tour. We all share one needle. I didn't know that. <laughs> what you don't know? You could fill up the Staples Center. This it? This is it. This is one of his new spots. What is this? It's his not-so-legal operation. He used to have one in Diamond Bar, but there was just way too much heat on the operation. Cops? Feds. Do you think you let me come in there and film? Um, I doubt it, but I'll ask. It's just so cool. She's nice, huh? What the hell does she see in you? I don't know. It's a good question. You did? <laughs> yeah. Can't believe your luck. Carmen, my sweet. Uh, Ivan. Mm. <laughs> this the man with movie camera, obviously. I used to go to film school in Ukraine. Lots of fun those days. <laughs> Federico probably told you about Leo's little scrape with the law. Yeah. So his lawyer. Rothstein. I hooked him up with that guy. Really? Yeah. Yeah. He got him into rehab. <laughs> Problem is, we're a little light in the admission fee area. How light? 2,500. So, you see, we were hoping you would break us off 2,500 and Pretty Pussy product so we can go door to door. Just to raise the funds for Leo. You want me to front you 2,500 of Pretty Pussy? No, not front. We want the wholesale rate. Like what you sell us a petco for. What do you guys make here? Cat toys for cats. Toys that cats like tech. That's a big business, huh? Big business, cat toys, take. I would never ask, but you know how I feel about Leo. <sighs> Anochka, give tour. So, what happens in here? We grow. We clip. And here, we finish. You like to smoke it? What do you think? You like green, you match. It is the color of money. Got it! Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> There's this design studio downtown full of ex-gang members, graffiti artists, editors, great friends of mine that want some. All right, let's go. Lipstick. Muscle car. Dipstick. Stick shift. Cowboy bar. Eight ball. Climbing tree. Risking enough, like Will carrying it, we have to actually to smoke it in the car. It's bad enough that we're on, holding on. all this. Such a nice Hot night. Be careful what you ask for. A dime's worth of wishes. Will I ever see them? I believe today is going to be a wonderful day. Each day, better than the next. I am always in the right place at the right time. I can't argue with that. My mind has unlimited potential. Very true. He's down the hall. Thanks. Mm -hmm. 
Baby, come read the affirmation with me. Hermes? Oh, my. What the fuck are you doing here? How are you? <laughs> uh, I heard you were upstate. I heard you were dead, man. Who told you that? Jessica told me. <laughs> she wants me fuck? dead. <laughs> it looks good. It looks I mean, really what's good. with the paparazzi and shit? Oh, he don't, it's just my brother. He's got issues. Don't worry. <laughs> How are you? It's like his own personal diary. Don't All worry, right. Don't worry, don't worry. Don't let me see it. I am very impressed. Very cool. Yeah, I'm computer designer now. Well, I'm trying to get into rehab myself. Well, this ain't it. This isn't rehab. <laughs> and, <blocked>. uh, <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm and, and um, I'm selling some weed to raise funds to get into rehab. So you want some? <laughs> no, man. I don't do drugs anymore. I'm three months, five days, and two hours sober. No one's gonna see this. You know what? I'll sponsor you. Okay, you could sponsor me. Fuck the weed. Just come check out this dog. He's a police dog. His name's Cerberus. You're gonna love him. Come on. <laughs> Did you not read the no soliciting sign at the door? Are you gonna report me now? <laughs> when was the last time I saw you? It was at the coach and hound? Or... Horses. Horses, yeah. Yeah. No dice. Let's go. E, e grapes, también. E watermelon. E watermelon. Sandia. Yeah, grapes on the Sandia. Trail. I knew that. I was going to say. Watermelon. Gracias. <laughs> watermelon. Muchas gracias. Qué calor. Joder. Qué caliente. No. How do you say in Spanish? Qué calor. How did it go in there? Qué calor. Joder. You didn't sell any? No. Dealing's a tough gig, man. I'm not made for this shit. <laughs> Nobody wants to buy weed. They want the harder shit, right, Leo? Yeah. Oh. Hey, is this the, uh, is this the South Central Farm? Oh, yeah. Yeah, what's left of it? I read about this. <gasps> That's it now? Do you know the story? Some developer bought the land 15 years ago. Then the city took it under eminent domain to build a garbage incinerator site. The community protested and then built the largest urban farm in the United States. And then the developer sued the city to get his land back, won, and then refused to sell it back to the community even though they raised $16 million to get it back. <sighs> People are so deceptive and greedy. The only thing you can do is get as intoxicated as possible until it's all just fucking over. That's such bullshit. You can actually do something about it. Like what? Make movies? For example, yes. Seven men in a dustbin congress Standing in a row for a final harvest There's a swinging motion to the shadows As if the sun above Can we drive around and, and, sh and shoot this? No, we're not. Look at that, right. they're pulling out the last tree. Sparrows diving in the wounds arriving Playing games with floating dead flowers revolving People go to the movies to be entertained, that's it. Nobody wants to be whipped. People were protesting that farm for months. But the bitch didn't eat for like 28 days. Please don't call her a bitch. Did that make a difference? You should have killed the developer. But violence just begets violence. It'll just perpetuate the cycle of oppression and inequality. What does that get you? And that's what to grow on. But don't come to me and cry. Mayday. Because it doesn't work. What, so Leo, you're saying you should have been motivated by fear? Fear may be the one thing stronger than greed. But don't come to me and cry. Mayday. Because it doesn't work that way. Right you're cold? You're all sweating. It's freezing. Balls in here. Yeah. I'm melting. Jesus. Shalom, You got good meds in here. I'm serious. You're serious. When the trigger can just be made of plastic, and the blood can just be something that just ruined the fabric on the uniform, and you could just burn up with matches, but your eyes fall shut as reality disquiets, and you finally know that what has happened today is going to be a part of you. Better be a big payday But it 
doesn't look that way. My life's like that accident. You're just slowing down to look. Where are we? Jordan down. You think I can film here? Yeah, they love it. <laughs> What's Jordan Downs? Projects. It ain't no war on drugs. It's just a war on us. We just out here surviving, surviving. They made this game for us. They put the blame on us. This is Mila, the cameraman. Fuck you. No, you chicken, neither paper stacking or waiting for public assistance. I got a hustle, that vision pimping the system in my blood. I'm a thug. You guys are great. Yeah. We grew up without a pot. My silver spoon was missing. My papa stole it for his heroin addiction. No, Here. Like hell. It's like hell. It's on YouTube. It's crazy. So much shit can happen to get shooting right now, man. Big homies and shit, just chilling, you know, living a good life out here, you know, getting money and shit. That's all we trying to do. You feel me? Why is it like hell? Man, this shit crazy. Police can come Police don't let a nigga live out here, man. You can't do nothing. You don't got, no, got no freedom. freedom. None of that shit, oh. man. What are the police most bother you guys about? Shit, gang injunction. Everything. What's that? Shit, you can't be around three people. They can come get us right now nah, if they for want nothing. to. Like for what? For being yeah, like this. Just for being too deep. Plus, I got purple. Yeah. What's the purple signify? Great. 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 Red and blue make purple. Yeah. You didn't know that? Want two crayons to see? We definitely gonna sell this motherfucking weed. You know what I'm saying? I got you. I got some little hungry cats over there, man. They probably suck that right up. You guys play for money? Yeah, we shoot for money. Can you get arrested for for gambling? <laughs> they gambling. taking money out your pocket and the dice and all that. We live for this shit right here, though. Life. My prediction is resistance and my profit. My wisdom may come from street knowledge. Ghetto gospel, young black and hostile. To the oppressive system in the form of police and prison. And don't forget religion, time to make a pimp decision. To make a stand for something or fall for nothing. Don't be your glutton for punishment. Us against them, my niggas versus the government. Who we fooling? We really ready. They steady training in Caracas. You Andy Miller knockers. Niggas is drinking vodka. 1254, Oh, man, like, what up? Oh, it up, got it up, ready to add it up. You do the math, so you better remember what Robert Nelson once told you to get up and get out like what happened to Wasabi. They got 23. Why are you trying to haggle me for this? Do you know where this is from? Pull that shit out, man. Let them see that, man. That's real Did shit. You she will come back for the two. Two gonna be right now, man. We got three fucking three, man. Last She ain't take it, Dad. So how come you guys aren't, uh, aren't together? Oh, just like. The love an addict. Yeah, it's what an addict.
the real shit, right? Follow me. Yo, where's Bella? She's with Carmen. She's where? She's with Carmen. She'll be fine. Yo, we got like an hour left. What are you doing? We make a documentary, right? Not right now. Follow me. Leo. Time's running out, man. What are we doing here? I don't want to make... I can't film in here. Come on in. These are my friends. Come on in. Just talk to him. You heard me, brother? Yeah. You mind if I film you? Yeah, you want me to look in the camera or what? <laughs> you know, your brother's like an angel. He takes care of like nine people down here. Keeps like a, a constant supply of clean needles. People use dirty needles otherwise? We use whatever we can get, you know? Government don't give us clean needles. They want us dead. Your brother. About two weeks ago, he uh, helped his sister buy a house. What do you mean? Yeah. Yeah, he, uh, see that her baby's daddy OD'd, right? And uh, left her homeless and she had like all this debt and he shows up one day with like like five, 20 g's man boom just gave it to her my life hmm? nothing doesn't that just allow people to keep living like this instead of getting sober and cleaning up their lives i mean what? They got... you rather uh, i don't know they get aids bring it home to their family the kids. No. You sure you're his brother, man? No, that didn't come out right. I mean, you'd be surprised how far a little love and, and just care goes. People need that. Come on in. Oh, shit. It's up, Taylor. You can film this. This is like your office, huh? What are you doing with the water? I'm uh, getting ready to cook. I've never seen this in real life before. It's so nasty, dude. It's not what it looks like in the movies at all. You all see a bunch of guys getting all euphoric after they fix. Bunch of dramatic movie bullshit. What does it feel like? It used to feel fucking amazing. Imagine floating on a billion tiny satin pillows. And then imagine when you weren't that high, what used to just feel normal now feels lower than you've ever felt before. It used to give me this uh, sense of meaning and oneness with everything. But now I just fix not to get sick. I don't even get high anymore. A little high. <laughs> oh, are you shooting your foot? Dude, it's all infected. What are you doing? Well, I can't watch. That makes me nauseous. <laughs> That's right. You get nauseous when you see a paper cut. Come on, man, let's go. We can still, we'll figure something out. Let's get you Rio. <laughs> uh, you don't have to do this. Dude, we still got like an hour and a half. We're gonna figure something out. We always do. I can just take one more big shot and go to sleep for good. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then uh, it'll all be over and you go back to your life. No, oh, don't say that, man. <laughs> Please. Come on, let's go. There you guys are. Where the fuck have you been? Get in the car. I have an idea. Where are we going? Come on. Carmen left with Brad, but I got the weed, and we have a plan. What is this place? Where did you hear about this? My new friends in Watts. 
told me about this guy. This guy will buy anything for anything. It's a last ditch <laughs> effort. Uh, we gotta get rid of this weed. We gotta see if it's gonna work. Just follow my lead, okay? Carmen gave you the I weed? What? Carmen gave you the weed? Yeah, it's in the car. for that shit? Yeah, absolutely. Actually, um, we're You're here... You're me in my damn rest? I'm so sorry. We're here. Uh, a friend of yours recommended you because we're actually from a new cable reality show. And we are doing a segment on high rolling strollers, kind of a Cribs type show. Oh, so Ziggy said you? It's not Ziggy. It's uh, uh, a friend of yours actually down in Watts. Oh, yeah, that's right. Watts, that's the real shit. That's the down low, yeah. man. That's the real. We can maybe come in and talk some business that's right. Watch the feet, watch the feet, watch the feet, and then watch the feet. Bam! Right in the face. Mr. Shasta? Yeah. I just want to check out your facilities and see if they qualify. Oh, you know, I'm so sorry. My, my hospitality was all down. I was, I was meditating. I was thinking about Buddha, Ganja. I was thinking about Yoda. Welcome to the Shasta domain. That's right. Shasta's always ready for a fight, ready for somebody to come in here and fight it. Bam! I can watch Brady Bunch, Jetsons. I can watch all five bass. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got to take this. You know, I be getting calls all the time. Uh, yeah, please. Take your time. Yo, who is? Yo, yo, yo. Yeah. No, I had to erase it because people be calling up. I have to say, Mommy, I need Look, Mom, I'll call you later. I got, I got people from the television here. It's really important. Yeah, I'll call you later. All right, all right, girl. Peace. But uh, as you can see, we are in the front room here. This is where magic be happening over here, over here. It, it be happening all around. Because we are stars. Everybody's a star. Come here, check it out, cameraman. This right here, that look beautiful, don't it? That is the eye. Now, that's made from the skins of an endangered species of, of stingray. Actually, that's the fake eye to mislead the predator. You calling my cover fake, man? I pay like Boku for that, man. That's no, the real deal right there. That's the, the real deal. The eye is fake. Don't be coming to my house telling me my shit is fake. I let everybody in here, and now you be saying my shit is fake? No, Mr. Shasta, I think he's just admiring that. The eye is fake to mislead the predator. OK, I, I hear what you're saying, man. I was just playing. I was just playing. Fantastic. That's, uh, yeah, no, it's, 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 I love it. It's my so, baby. So, Shasta, is there any way we could sit down and have a little chat? Because we have, I think, an offer oh. that you might be interested in. Oh, yeah, man. What You know, we could be sitting, uh, you know, let me slip into something a little more comfortable. And then, uh, you know, we could, uh, <laughs> we could we? talk about shit. Oh, please have a seat. Please, Thank producer, you. have a seat. Cameraman, come on over. Don't, don't be shy. So tell me, uh, what do you do? Well, I'm, a, I'm an artist. I mean, Shasta's an artist, a producer, a, a rapper, a, a hip hopper. I'm a fighter. I know heads in, like, NYC, L.A., Denver. So how do you make your... I have been blessed, I mean, blessed, blesses, blessings. Trust fund? Ja Rasta, that's right, I'm a trust of Shastai. So, well, we may have some, some party favors to offer you for your next soiree. Right, right, like firecrackers, like. My partner here has some tree that you might be interested in. I got, you want a trapeze, I got trees outside that can swing into the pool. We did some that at one party. marijuana. Oh, yeah, right. I was just playing. Yeah, that's right. Marijuana. Shit, of course. I mean, you can't have no party without no tree. Okay. All right. What My you got? My partner and I happened to come across a pound of medical grade cloth. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Bless Allah. Be praised, Rastafari. Thank you very much. This ain't legal, is it, man? We can't be. Oh, yeah, we're talking medical grade. Oh, the legal, illegal, the new medical grade, the yeah. new. It's that, that's just, they chemically enhance it. That's really oh, strong. Oh, strong. And I think we can give them a deal because, you know. All right, we're willing to let it go for $156.25 an ounce. 32 ounces in the pound. That's right. 156 times 32 equals 5G. Right. I feel like I'm being robbed. robbed. Excuse me one second. Yeah. You sure you were not talking about yourself? Yeah. Yeah. We can get way I was at a very nice house and we are in a situation. 5G is one pound. 
have is going to be carried. Oh. Um, can you tell me the numbers again? Obviously, yeah, we, we need, we need oh. Ash. There it is. Oh my god. There you go. Oh my god. That, oh my god. Oh my. Oh man, that's the sticky icky. That's the Bin Laden armpit. That's like cave hopper. That's. Trust this. Let's see what we do. Not too bad. Oh, you shouldn't have me. <laughs> you gotta look like my nice best friend. Come here, dude. Come here. Yo, man. Holy shit, run! Oh, my God, this is mine. I think we're gonna be early, guys. <laughs> like 20 minutes early. What you reading, Taco? What you reading? Oh shit. What? Oh shit. What? You just ate the laxatives. What? The That's Mexican laxatives. That is oh my good. God, he's gonna have an explosion. Poor <laughs> taco. Oh no, taco. You better pull over. I can't, I'm on the fucking freeway. I'm yeah, gonna pull man, it's gonna smell bad. But you're not gonna like that at all. So fucked. Was I, I speeding? Knew it. Bella, just, just switch with me. No. No, no, no. Be reasonable. What? No. Leo, you better reasonable? be than you. No. Are you crazy? I'm not switching with you. You don't want to fucking go to prison for a stolen car, Bella. I'm not you don't want a fucking fine. record. I'm a first time offender. I'll be fine. Leo, stop it. Are you fucking crazy? Stop it. Leo, are you crazy? Listen, we'll just explain to them what happened. No. Just Leo. switch with me. Leo. No, stop it. Get the fuck off of me. What the fuck are you doing? This is insane. You're going to go to fucking prison? After everything we've Leo, done today, Leo, stop! Leo, I got an idea. Just tell them you're me. Tell them you're me. I've done that. That's why you don't no, have a driver's license. No, what are you doing? Stop. Just relax. No! You left tail lights out. You almost hit two cars back there. I'm sorry. Have you been drinking tonight? No, it's our dog's been jumping up and down. Taco Plots! Mila. Plots! Do you have a license registration? I don't have a license for registration. No, I'm need you to step out of the vehicle. Okay. You know how annoying that is? <laughs> Should we come in with you? I got it. Sure? Yeah. You got the money? See you in six months. Oh! Each day better than the next, right? 
Exactly. Every day gets worse, like I always say. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Hey, hey, what's the matter? Can't you get enough for you? <laughs> Tell Carmen I love her. Thanks. Take a bus? Do they have buses in LA? This day is getting older. Fading light, it's beautiful. This wind is blowing colder. And too soon, I feel it's poor. It's been an hour. We just dropped off my brother about an hour ago. Leonardo Strombo. Yeah, Leo. I just want to see how he's doing. Slows your mind, mind. 